select the search which is next to the home and then select search and here type apple and as soon as you type ap you can see apple tv as one of the suggestions so select it and then select apple tv as you can see it is free to download so simply select get it will take some time for it to download and install once the installation is finished select open in order to be able to use Apple TV, you need to sign in. So select sign in or create Apple ID. There are three different ways to sign in or sign up, but the easiest way is to scan this QR code. Otherwise, you could go directly to activate.apple.com or sign in with your remote control. So you can use your iPhone, open the camera app, point it towards the QR code and your camera then should detect the QR code so select it to open the link then you should get a message on your iPhone saying do you want to sign in to idmsa.apple.com with your Apple ID whatever Apple ID that you use on your iPhone if it is the same Apple ID that you have for your Apple TV then select continue otherwise you can select use a different Apple ID so I select continue and then you should get a message saying you have successfully signed in using your Apple ID your TV will refresh to continue meanwhile on the TV you can see Apple TV app is loaded up and you can start watching whatever you want on Apple TV in order to exit Apple TV you need to press back two times and then select exit easiest way to open Apple TV again in the future when you're on the home page come down to the section where it says recently used apps and you should be able to see Apple TV and if you select it it would open another way to open Apple TV is to go to here select it now you should be able to see all your apps including Apple TV simply go on it and select it to open it you could also hold the Alexa button and then say Apple TV to open Apple TV app 